Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Lisa and in this video it is actually the part two video of my updated Majuri collection. So if you guys didn't see it, I actually have part one up already. I actually make one of these videos after every few months to update my Majuri collection, but since it has been such a long time since I updated my Majuri collection, I gathered over 40 items in this time and so the first video I did it on rings as well as necklaces and and some accessories from Majuri so you can go check it out here. I uploaded it not too long ago and in today's video I'm going to be doing the rest of the categories. I'll be covering earrings, earring charms as well as bracelets. So if you guys are new to my channel and you're, this is your first time seeing me I actually do make quite a few Majuri videos so you can check all of them out here. It is everything that I own from Majuri and I update my collection like I said quite frequently. I also have a few styling videos so if you're curious about how to style your Majuri products you can go check them out as well. And as usual, I also have 10% off of Majuri. If you use the links down below the discount, it will be automatically applied upon checkout if this is your first time purchase. And also, if you want to check out my entire collection all in one place, you can look at my website, lisawaitcom slash Majuri. You'll be able to see every single item I own from Majuri. And if you click on the item, the link is also embedded so you can get your discount as well. So without further ado, let's get started on the rest of the collection. Okay, so I'm gonna start with earrings. So with earrings, the first item that I wanted to share with you guys is actually one that I got in both solid gold and white gold, but it is the Pave Diamond Hoop Earrings. Obviously, I got them as a pair, but I'm just showing you one of each right now, but this is what it looks like, and I just absolutely love it because these are pretty much the bold hoops. If this is your first time coming across my videos, Majuri has these iconic hoops called the bold hoops, and they're very small and dainty and they're great for every day. You can actually just leave them on. I sleep with them too. It's actually quite comfortable and they actually came out with a larger size and for this earring in particular, they have it in both the non-diamond and diamond versions. So I recently started switching over to the diamond versions and so for the bigger size, I got them, like I said, in solid gold and white gold and I also got them in the diamond version because I absolutely love how that looks in my ear and it also matches the smaller versions which is what I also got this time since you guys saw me last. I also got the smaller versions in white gold in the diamond. I have the gold version as well. I got those even longer ago and I'm pretty sure you guys knew about that one so this is just from my update but I absolutely love styling these together. I usually like to wear them side by side. I would wear the bigger one in my first lobe and the smaller one in my second lobe and usually for my third lobe, I would actually wear this white gold stud right here. This is one of my favorite, favorite studs. If you guys are unfamiliar with it, white gold, you can also wear it just kind of like solid gold where you never have to take it off. So you can wear it showering, you can wear it swimming, etc. It is not like gold over me, which is gold coating. And for that type of jewelry, you will need to take it off before you shower because it can't come in contact with water, soap, etc. So it's best if you take it off. But all three of these items you can wear indefinitely if you choose to, or if you're just uncomfortable, you can obviously take it off at night as well. Unfortunately, I don't know why my third lobe, which I pierced, I don't know if you guys follow my vlogs, but you guys would have seen my Majuri piercing video it was in one of my vlogs and this hole in particular I have pierced probably three times now on my right lobe and each time it does not stay it will always grow back because it gets like super painful I do take care of it when I am healing but for some reason it just will not stick so I'm honestly not sure what I'm doing wrong but I might have to re-pierce my ears again but for now I can only show you with my two lobes and for now I only have my two lobes but speaking of what I am wearing I also want to show you guys what I'm currently wearing in my ear so the first one is actually a statement piece and this is in the gold verme and it's actually part of their collection with luar this is actually a two-part piece so this piece can actually be worn with this white piece as well that's hooked on there or obviously you have the flexibility to take it off and just wear it as a big statement piece like this and the second piece that I have on here is the large diamond hoop earrings and I absolutely 
love these diamond earrings because these ones they come in the large medium and small i have all three of them i actually used to back when i didn't close up my piercing holes i used to wear them all together and it just looks so classy sleek because of the diamond because of the gold and on top of that because this is the hoop earring that actually closes at the top you can actually swing an ear charm in between and make it your own and customize it a little bit more so i'm going to show you the ear charms in a second but for now i'm going to move on to the next earring another hoop earring that i have absolutely been loving is this one right here so this one is one with spears and once again because it closes all the way around this is another earring where you can dangle hoop charms through it so all you do is you pretty much put this through the hole and then you put it through your ear and you will then have a earring with a little hoop charm that dangles from your earring so i just think that is super cute but i actually really really like to wear these alone and i absolutely just love these hoop earrings so much i actually i don't know what is up with them i think it's just because they're super simple and it just has these spheres on them so compared to the diamond i just feel like if you want something even more low-key these are the earrings for you for sure the next earring i want to share with you guys is one that i got asked so much all over tiktok every time i would wear them but it is these ones right here and it's this earring that just has a line but i just like how there's like this kink in the middle as you guys can see so when you wear it it's like this against your ear but it kind of like moves around like so and this just makes it look super super cute and if you like wear and style it with other pieces it looks really really good together so i usually style it with other hoop charms and it has a really really cute look so in the past, when I've been asked on TikTok, the one that I would pair it with would be the earrings that I just showed you, the one with the spheres. I would pair it with a charm. That is just a simple charm that dangles through. The last earrings I want to show you guys are these flower earrings. So if you guys watch the part one video, you guys will see that I also got the flower ring. I just thought it was so cute, but these are in the solid gold as well. And these are in the flower ones and they have the diamond in detailing and I just think it's so cute and so perfect for summer. I just feel like there's such statement -y studs and super cute to kind of wear, especially around this time of the year because I don't know i just feel like there's this whole like flowery thing you can even see from my nails that i got flowers on my nails as well and i just think it's such a cute little vibe okay so moving on to the next section we're going to be talking about earring charms i have five hoop charms to share with you and these ones are my absolute favorite from the entire collection until they come up with more i'll see how many more i collect but these are the ones that i'm the happiest with i just feel like they are so cute the first one is this emerald charm i'm also going to be showing it to you guys on these earrings right here the first ones look like this i just feel like this gemstone is super super cute it also comes in multiple different colors but this is the color i chose and i absolutely love it i just feel like it definitely adds like a little gem to your earring and it doesn't even look like it's a separate entity like honestly if you just look at it from afar it looks like one earring but in general i feel like i and i spoke about this before but hoop charms are amazing because i feel like it's kind of this a la carte option where you can add and take away from jewelry you already own without having to buy another full earring that just literally has this one charm but you can just add these charms to your own existing earrings without having to pay the full retail price of an earring that comes with a charm that doesn't move the next charm i want to share with you is probably one of my favorites and i actually can't even explain to you why this one is one of my favorites it is this one right here and i just feel like this reminds me of this like dainty little flower also like perfect for spring i just really really like the design of this i feel like it looks really cute when you put it on and it just has one of the most wonderful detailing and gemstones that i've ever seen and together it just looks really great i also think you can double layer some of these charms although i do feel like you have to definitely choose some of the most basic charms in order for it to look good or else it's going to look too distracting and too crowded the next charm is also one of my favorites i don't know also once again what it is is about this charm but this charm just makes the earring just look 
so 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 cute with this little detailing and i feel like it has a little bit of a stone in the front and together it just looks so cute and i think you should definitely get these ones as well another idea is you can also mix and match you don't need to wear identical ones one on each ear but also just a word of advice when you do order these charms make sure you have the quantity right because the first time that i ordered these charms i actually only ordered one when i meant to order both because i do kind of like the symmetrical look and when i found out that i only ordered one i was so disappointed because i was so excited to wear my new hoop charms and i had to wait for the second shipment to come before i could wear them the next one is also so a really really big favorite of mine it is this pearl one this one also has a little bit of a detailing at the very bottom if you guys can see I just feel like this makes it look so 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 classy once again pearls is just something that can make any outfit look super classy and dainty so definitely take a look at this one if you guys are a fan of pearls the last one is the one i've already shown you guys which is the just simple simple bar even though this is simple i feel like there's a beauty in simplicity and like i said when i wore these earrings i got asked so many times where these earrings were from especially when i paired it with the bar earring right here i feel like these two together make such a great combination but i feel like if you're trying the ear charms for the first time i feel like my personal recommendation if you had to narrow down one would be this one right here this one is probably my favorite one i just feel like there's something about this one that is so cute it just kind of looks like a combination of stars but flowers at the same time i don't know if that makes Sense because it's all like vertical but that's kind of the vibe that I get moving on to bracelets so there are four new bracelets I got since the last time you guys saw me the first one is this chain bracelet right here this bracelet right here you guys might have seen in that video that I filmed with my boyfriend um, he got this version but in also in titanium the solid gold version ends up looking a lot thinner than the titanium version but both can be worn at all times I just feel like this chain right here is a very good combo of like dainty as well as androgynous if you are someone that doesn't like that super feminine look i feel like this bracelet is like the perfect one and because it's solid gold you never have to take it off but it just looks super 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 cute and i just think it's such a great basic piece in fact for Mother's Day, I actually got my mom a chain bracelet from a jury. It was a little bit thicker and she said it's her favorite bracelet. She wears it all the time and she never takes it off. The next bracelet I wanna show you is another one from their emerald collection if you guys watched the first part of this video you guys will know that they recently came out with a emerald collection and the collection itself has so many different pieces that have gemstones in the color green and this one is no different this one just dangles the green and it ha kind of has the shape of the baguette so i absolutely love it and because of green just making a comeback into this world i just feel like it is such a great dainty yet statement piece and just kind of stands out a little bit so if you are someone who doesn't really like loud jewelry but you do want something that kind of catches your eye I feel like this one is so perfect for that purpose the next bracelet that I wanted to show you guys is this one right here so if you guys remember one of the favorite pieces from one of my last collections was the paper clip necklace and I told the story a million times but initially I didn't even want the paper clip necklace because I just thought the paper clip necklace was super thick but when i actually got it was super dainty or sorry daintier it's not super dainty it's daintier than i thought and because it's in solid gold it was just such a great size i ended up wearing it all of summer 2022 no sorry yes i ended up wearing it all of summer 2022 i wore it all throughout europe as well interchangeably with some other statement pieces but that was kind of like the one solid gold piece that i wouldn't really take off so when they came out with the paper clip bracelet i knew i had to get it because i just loved it so much in case you also don't know you can add charms to the paper clip collection so you can add it to the necklace you can also add it to the bracelet but i actually kind of just like the way it looks itself so this is obviously a option but once again i just really like how it gives you that flexibility and instead of just buying an entire new bracelet just to have it have a charm on it i just feel like you can just add it yourself if you want to the next bracelet that i got is actually one that was inspired by a friend this is the diamond 
diamond bar bracelet. I actually saw her with this bracelet on and after I saw her with this bracelet on, I was like, I need to get that bracelet. It is so cute and I absolutely just love the detailing. It just has a little bit of diamond. So once again, not like super loud. You guys all know that the diamond tennis bracelet is one of my favorite bracelets. If you don't see me wear it anymore, it's not because I don't like it because I actually get DMs about it. They'll be like, where's your diamond tennis bracelet? Cause like they'll watch my story and they don't see it. So a little background, you guys know how much I love that bracelet, okay? I wear it literally all the time until I met my boyfriend and he's like, it catches, he's like every time I hug him or whatever, he's like, it catches like the hairs on the back of his neck. Part of me is kind of just like, okay, suck it up. But I feel like it started bothering him. So I ended up taking it off a little bit. Um, but I, I don't even think that's true. Like I've just, I've worn it for so many years and I never had a problem. But anyway, this is kind of, have been also like the replacement one because I love my diamond tennis bracelet so much but this one gives him less of an issue apparently so I don't know anyway I still like wear the diamond tennis bracelet though like I I'm starting to just like not care anymore I'm just gonna put it on but this is an alternative if you're like okay the diamond tennis bracelet is a little too much for me then this one is a really good option as well so anyway with that being said this was the part two video of the Majuri collection I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and and make sure you check out all the other Majuri videos if you guys liked this one and if you guys are looking to purchase Majuri for the first time once again you get 10% off immediately upon checkout if you use the links down below but with that being said thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you in the next video bye